Today I'm going to interview Dr. Sanamula sir, the HOD uh, of the Department of Chemistry uh, of HKPK College of Engineering. Uh, so we will directly move on to the questions. So how do you feel satisfied in this profession as a teacher? See, this job I chose with the passion. Uh, I was influenced by my teachers. There were a few teachers, so good. So I could have gone through any other profession uh, with my you know, qualification or my percentage. But thank God my teachers were influenced me to choose this profession. I came with my passion. Okay, really I'm enjoying the correct? And absolutely I'm satisfied. So next question, sir. Uh, did your studies or present generation influence their teaching? Definitely. See, I have many students say I started my career right from 1984, 85. I completed my post action. I started my career in MS Rama Institute of Technology. Till today, my students are in touch with me. That in, I indicate that, like you know, how I have, like you know, I impressed them, like you know, how they are like encouraged them. Yes, of course. Uh, two cases I tell you. My students, students are my, like you know, my students, children are my students. Uh, almost three of my students earlier, like you know, those who are in other colleges, the children are my students. They have completed the minimum they are studying. That is where. So that's how I think uh, I'm satisfied with this institution and which made me to like, you know, continue in this profession. And inspiration only the students' inspiration which made me to continue in this profession. Okay, sir. Next question. Uh, how do students influence or contribute to their lives? See, one thing I'll tell you one thing. So what is happening nowadays? The parents are like you know choosing the course what their children have to do. That is very wrong. Right? So every parents want their children to you know, become engineers, software engineers, or doctors, or like this. So this is a very wrong concept. You should give your freedom to the children because they should move in their field where they are interested. That is happening. I think that has to be like, you know, parents has to be, you know. Uh, we have to educate the parents and the uh, The reason is many failures I see because it is forcibly for engineering courses only I see. Many parents are their post, their post with their dad, in between they have discontinued. So I feel, I think students have to choose the field uh, to their future uh, career to build this future and career. That's what I can see. Okay. Crisis of pandemic was more overwhelming than any other personal crisis. I can say this is not only personal crisis. Uh, our, our world it happened. Each and every human being is affected with this pandemic. It's not only personal, uh, lifestyle has changed. Yes, sir. And you know, the most affected are the students, I tell you. Still they're affected, still their offline classes are not started. Yes, sir. They're all on online. So online, I think online mode, really I am not happy with that. What I am supposed to deliver, it is not happening. Yes, sir. And what students has to learn, it is not happening. This is in particularly engineering, you need a lot of the practical experience. Mm -hmm where they can undergo training in the labs. That is not happening. So if, if, if you wanted to continue education, definitely you can continue on online. Then why you need the technical universities, all this. So I'm really unhappy and I feel this is a gap where the students are carrying out all of their life. Because what they are supposed to learn this gap, they are not learning. So that gap always will be there. In so somehow the students has to like, you know, find an alternative opportunities so that uh, they you know that gap they have to fill. So next question so how should students change themselves for the future? So for example I tell you here I have seen we have several branches. They civilly have mechanically have computer electronics information say everybody wants to become a software engineer. But in fact I tell you one thing there are a lot of opportunities See, see, one thing I tell you, don't like, you know, when you have become a, a computer science information science, don't choose uh, only, there is only software in it. There are many opportunities, a very field in computer science. So, you look for the opportunity. So, evolve and explore the new opportunities. So, don't like, you know, fix up only software, software, software. I tell you, in fact, the software profession is not life, I tell you one thing. You are ending up your life by 45 years. 
So therefore, evolve and explore the new opportunities. Particularly, I'll tell you the core branches, civil, mechanical, electrical, yeah, these have a lot of scope. But these, unfortunately, these uh, professionals also move into the software engineer, which is where, like, you know, I am a bit, uh, you know, back step I have taken. That's why I tell my students always, it is not only in the world, only software. There are many areas where you can explore. You have to explore. It is because, you see, the thing is, you have, like, you know, stuck to your Instagram, Facebook, or WhatsApp, but you are not, like, you know, uh, reading the newspapers. Uh, you know, this year, this present generation doesn't have a habit of reading the newspaper. But till today, I will read the newspaper. So, newspaper use a lot of information, what is happening around you, what, is, what are the new opportunities. So, I feel, I think you have to explore this high tech. Right? So, anyway. Sir, next question is, uh, what is the message you would like to give to students? That's what, just now I told the last uh, uh, question I have answered. So, Please, I tell you one thing. It's not only software. There are many, many fields. Please kindly explore this. So you the contribution is there. And one more thing, what I have seen. Once you complete your engineering, you avail all the facilities from the government, which is private our government, and then you become an engineer, a very good engineer. So then you move on to the other countries. You contribute whatever they have for the knowledge. That is very, very, very sad news. Sad part of your life. Here only India only you can like you know what I say uh, your knowledge you can uh, share to build the nation that's what I mean. Thank okay. you sir. All the best. Thank you very much.